Overnight, more power outages from severe weather across the South. More than 150,000 customers affected from Georgia to Texas. The National Weather Service confirms a tornado caused this damage near Savannah, Georgia. Video from AccuWeather showing a tornado in Newton, Georgia. New video shows lightning striking a traffic camera in the area where part of I-95 was shut down due to fallen power lines. In neighboring Alabama, a tornado tore through the city of Eufaula, damaging several homes and businesses. My Lord. In Mississippi, monster hail. This chunk of ice measuring nine inches in circumference. A possible tornado east of Dallas shredded a two-story building and damaged cars. Dangerous weather also hitting the Northeast. A New Jersey Parks employee was hit by lightning while painting lines on this soccer field. It was really like a bomb. It was like a huge bomb. The worker expected to survive after first responders revived him. He didn't have a pulse and began CPR. Once we were in the ambulance and he did get a pulse back, he did slowly begin to gain consciousness. North of the border, this massive tornado was caught on camera in Alberta, Canada. One local weather expert says he's never seen so many tornadoes in one day in that province. Meanwhile, more smoke from wildfires burning in Canada is drifting into the U.S. Minneapolis seeing its worst air quality yesterday since 1980. Today, some of that smoke moves over Chicago and Indianapolis. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.